Hi there, it's Tom with A2 Agile back with you again. And today we're going to be talking about music like I'll always like to do. And in particular, we're going to be talking a little bit about the difference between Western music and what you're listening to right now, which is Northern Indian classical music. This is a band, obviously called Shakti. It's a band that was around many years ago and is just doing a little reunion. And you may recognize the guitar player. That's John McLaughlin. He's in a band called Mahavishnu Orchestra, among other things. Played with Jeff Beck. Pretty well known. And Zakir Hussein on tabla, who I don't think we'll hear much of in this segment because I want to focus on something that's different about this music and Western music. Western music is based on 12 tones in a chromatic scale. And we tend to stick pretty tightly to those 12 tones. Northern Indian classical music, as you can hear, uses something called quarter tones or microtones. And I like this analogy with agile practice. Because to me, what's really interesting about this music is what happens in between those 12 tones. It's just beautiful. And with Agile practice, we often talk about planning and starting and ending sprints and, and the various meetings that we have to figure out the work we're going to do. But what's really interesting is the stuff that happens in between those microtones, if you will, of an Agile practice. During that time, small decisions get made, communications do or don't happen, collaborations are missed or they come together, and information is or isn't shared. So all these little things that happen can have a pretty big impact on the output and the outcomes of the work we do. So when we come to retrospect, and talk about the things that we could do better. It's easy to talk about those big whole notes, those, those 12 tones of the Agile process. But it's those microtones sometimes that make all the difference and they're easy to forget. So I encourage you, during your Agile practice, when you see an opportunity to talk about the events that happen in between those big notes, to make a little note, jot it down, so that you remember to talk about it in Agile practice, because there's a huge amount of learning opportunity there. I hope you found this music enjoyable. I found, hope you got something out of this little session today, and I hope you'll click the follow button so that you can join us again in the future. Thanks again, and we'll talk to you soon. <laughs>